Hello everyone, my name is Lacey and today I have a haul from Teddy Bees to share with you. This was the RTS after the last pre-order. Um, this was shipped a while ago. I forget exactly what day it was shipped, but it sat at the post office for I don't even know how long. Um, but it just came last night, so I just cut open the box. I didn't get anything out yet. Um, I honestly don't remember what scents I ordered, but I think I only got a few souffles and a couple tubs, I'm pretty sure. So um, here is her business card. Really cute. And there's all her information. I'll put the website in the description box below. Um, she is on Facebook, fairly active on Facebook, and that's usually where she updates for pre-orders and restocks and everything. Um, I think she updates her website also, but definitely the Facebook is where to go for all that kind of information. Sorry if you don't like the crinkling. I enjoy it, but uh, the sample is Hot Girl Summer. I don't know if I ever purchased this one. I'm not sure. I know it's Beach Nights and something. Is it like a perfume? Have I had this one before? I don't know. It's really good. I mostly get her Beach Nights, but I love her Beach Nights, so and like a perfumey note. That's nice. I can't remember if I've ever melted that. I don't know. That's good though. Sorry if I'm like talking weird. I keep biting my cheek and now I've created this like huge bump on the side of my cheek that I just continuously <laughs> bite and so it's like messing up my speech. It's ridiculous. Um, okay, let's start with the souffles, I guess. Um, oh, the first one I got is Christmas Trees and Cream with Crushed Candy Canes. I think this is a layered souffle. I've had Christmas Trees and Cream before. I've never had the Christmas Trees and Cream with Crushed Candy Canes, but I've heard really good things about it. Okay, so just straight out of the bag, I'm mostly getting the Crushed candy canes, but I want to pop it out because I'm pretty sure it's layered. And look how pretty it is. Oh, that smells really good. Let's see. Yeah, it's layered, so Christmas trees and cream is on the bottom. It smells really good. Oh, and there's red glitter on the bottom there. That's so pretty. Uh, yeah, that's good. I love that. I love crushed candy canes and I love Christmas trees and cream. So I figured I would like that. I only got a souffle. First of all, I figured all of the tubs would sell out right away. I think there were tubs of this available. I figured they would sell out right away. I didn't quite want to loaf. I figured this would be good enough for like this year. Um, Forward in October so I would probably give this a try this month um, maybe not like melt the whole thing but I would definitely try this and see how strong it is already because I mean that's almost two months of cure time um, the next one oh I was excited about this one this one is morning cup of Christmas and it is vanilla chai, cranberry chutney, apple marmalade, and a hint of fresh pine. And this was bor born, <laughs> uh, poured in September. Um, so I would definitely try this one. I wanted to try this because I saw Sarvi pick up this one in her RTS video. And she said the cranberry chutney in here was like really good <laughs> or really realistic or something. I don't know. She said the cranberry chutney was really good. So I wanted to try this one that is really good I definitely like that or maybe she said the apple marmalade I don't know oh I really like this oh 
man, this one I could have picked up a tub of. I really like that. Look how pretty. Wow, yeah, definitely the cranberry chutney and apple marmalade. I don't know if I'm getting pine. Man, the tubs are gonna be really hard to pop out. <laughs> oh, that is, I really like this. Um, and I don't know if you're gonna be able to see, there's some like really fine green shimmer in the red wax. She does such a good job with like making these so pretty. Oh, I love this. So I could be getting the vanilla chai. I'm definitely getting some spice notes, but that could be coming from the chutney. Mm. Do I get pine? I think I do. I think I really, really like this one. Oh, yeah, I can't wait to melt that. If I love that, um, when I try it, if I love it on warm, this is one that I would pick up a large quantity of because that smells bomb. Morning cup of Christmas. I, oh, oh, that smells good. I'm sorry if I'm bouncing you. Maybe I shouldn't sit them there. I was just sitting them on the table that you are sitting on, but I feel like it's shaking you. Okay. Let me find some more. The next one is White Woods and Bonfires. Yeah, Bonfires. <laughs> um, this is White Oak, Cashmere, Soft Woods, Vanilla, and Bonfire Bliss. So I'm coming around to Bonfire Bliss. It wasn't always my favorite because it doesn't smell like Bonfire to me, but once I started to appreciate it for what it is, I like it a lot more. Um, I saw several people talk about this one but I think it was Lexi that I saw talk about it and she said it smelled like what is that perfume or cologne is it like around the fireplace or by the fireplace or something like that she said it smelled like that to her um, and I can't tell you if it's a dupe or not because I don't really know what that smells like but I've been interested in smelling that scent I know another vendor offers it but I've never ordered from that vendor. So anyway, I wanted to try this. Either way, it sounded good. That's really nice. White oak, cash, definitely cashmere. Um, And I feel like, let's see. That's really nice. I feel like the Bonfire Bliss is not like in the forefront here. I feel like it's the white oak, cashmere, soft woods, vanilla, but then like a background of the bonfire bliss. Oh man, I like that a lot. And look how pretty. I'm gonna say that for everyone because they're all pretty. When was this poor? 1021. Like I said, I will probably try most of these um, soon and then I don't know. See how they are like I could try a little piece in, in the tea light warmer if it's not throwing then I'll just let it sit this smells really good and this has beautiful gold glitter on the bottom okay yeah I really like that one so far so good um, okay next one the North. This is vanilla balsam type, Palo Santo, marshmallow fireside, and a hint of smoldering firewood. So there was a lot of vanilla balsam in this restock, um, and I guess in the pre-order also. So I really had to, I really tried to narrow down my list. I had a lot, a lot on my list because everything sounded so good because I do, I have like dust from the squigglies on my hand. Um, I do love balsam, vanilla balsam, any kind of tree scent. So everything sounded good to me, but I didn't want to just pick up a million vanilla balsam scents. So I don't know if I got any other ones other than this, but I picked up the North. Oh man, and I'm so glad I did. This smells so good. Oh wow. <laughs> 
This is another one I could have definitely gotten a tub of at least. Oh man, I love that. There's what that one looks like. Again, beautiful. Oh my goodness, does this have, okay, Palo Santo, the smoldering firewood. I really like that note that she puts in. Um, it's a really good like fireside smoky kind of scent. It's not super overpowering. It's very apparent, but it's not like the only thing you can smell. Oh man, that smells so good. Let me pop it out. In. Okay. This wax is like, I guess it's brown. It's almost like a grayish kind of color. There's some gold glitter on the bottom. I love that she does that. Oh yeah, I really, really like this one. Man, man, <laughs> I should have got more. Ugh. Yeah, that's good. I definitely get the vanilla balsam, the Palo Santo. Um, I mean, I guess I get the marshmallow fireside. I think it's kind of getting, you know, lost in there a little bit, but I definitely get the smoldering, what is it? Smoldering embers, smoldering firewood. Mm, this is beautiful. That is a beautiful winter scent. I love that. Okay, I think I'm gonna stop them over there so I don't keep bouncing you guys around. Just sit on here beside me. Um, the next one, Oak Cider and Woods. I was excited for this too. Obviously I was excited for all of them. Um, I think I saw, I saw a couple people talk about this one too. I think it was Amy's Sense and Songs, Amy from Amy's Sense and Songs, who I saw talk about it. Or was it, it might have been Amy. Amy. I think I saw, oh, who did I see talk about this? Oh my gosh, it'll come to me. Somebody was like, this is really good. And I was like, it sounds really good. I think I'm gonna pick it up. Uh, it's warm mold cider, cedar, oak, vanilla, toasted marshmallow, pine cones, and smoked woods. It sounds amazing. Who was it? Was it Tashawn? Somebody was like, this scent looks really good. Oh, it is good. It reminds me, and this is what I kind of expected. It reminds me of Cedar Cider from Scentsy. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, I like that. It has that, like, shimmer glitter on top. That is good. This could be, this could be fall or winter for me. Oh man, I really like that. Yeah, it really reminds me of Cedar Cider from Scentsy and that is a love of mine. I'm excited to see how this is on warm because I'm sure there's gonna be a difference in those scents and I wonder if this one is gonna end up being a little bit better. Oh, I just love that cedar note with that like apple cider. Oh my goodness, that's good. Warm old cider, cedar oak, yeah. That is good. Oak woods and cider, I, or oak cider and woods, sorry. I uh, love that on cold. The next one, oh, I picked this one up. So it's ocean and this is a Downy Unstoppables dupe, I believe. I picked this one up because my son, um, Abel, he loves that scent, the ocean, is it ocean or ocean breeze or ocean mist? Whatever the ocean Downy Unstoppable scent is, he loves that scent. He smells it every time he goes to the store with me. He requests those Unstoppables every time I get Unstoppables. He gets kind of disappointed if I don't get that one. <laughs> so I wanted to pick this up and see if it was really similar to that. And then he'll love having it melting in his room. Um, so the note, the, the note, the notes are fresh air and crisp ocean breezes. And this was poured in September also. 
It smells just like it. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Um, it's blue and then there, it's blue with blue, like fine glitter on top. That's really good. I think he's gonna love this. I, I'm gonna let him smell it when he gets home from school and see if he likes it. Um, oh yeah, that's good. It smells just like it. So pretty. I'm gonna have to see how this throws. If it throws well, I'm definitely like, that is so pretty. I really like that. <laughs> if it throws well, I will get much more of this in the future. It's so good. It's, I wouldn't say it necessarily smells like laundry, even though it is a laundry dupe, like a laundry product dupe. It's just very fresh and clean. Yeah, and that like aquatic clean kind of scent. Mm, that's good. I'm glad I picked up that one. I'm closing these. Just double check before I or after I end this. And then I think all that's left are the tubs. Two tubs. Yeah. Um, the first one is Christmas Cafe. And this is warm breads and pastries, vanilla eggnog, and the slightest hint of spice. See, I don't even remember ordering this. <laughs> Um, I order and then I don't look back and then it's like a little surprise gift to yourself. So warm breads and pastries, vanilla eggnog, and the slightest hint of spice. I love eggnog scents and I was hoping since it says vanilla eggnog, it won't be obviously the like boozy eggnog. Um, but let's see. Ooh, that's pretty nice. Definitely, it says the slightest hint of spice. I feel like it's more than a hint of spice, but spice, but I like spice, so that doesn't bother me. And look at that. Oh, it's so pretty. Yeah, I think I like this. I want to try to pop it out. Oh, it's coming right out, I think. Yeah. Well, it was. There we go. Oh yeah, that's good. Um, definitely, definitely spicy though. Um, much more than a hint, but I really like that. It's kind of, what does it say? Bread and pastries? It's kind of like a yeasty, uh, like a yeasty baked goods situation. That I enjoy. Was this? This was poured eleven seventeen. So I don't know if this was one that was offered in the pre-order, if it, or if it was one that was new for the RTS. But I really like that. Mm, that's good. It smells very Christmassy. Yeah, I like that very happy with this order because I know this last one I'm gonna love too um, but Christmas cafe really nice the only one I only had one jump out of my cart and it was Pacific Northwest winter I think is what it was called that's the only thing that jumped out of my cart um, other than that I was in and out in like three minutes I think once the site went live um, so that one sold out super fast, but I have a feeling she'll offer it again since it did sell out super fast and I will be getting that. I forget what all was in it, but it sounded amazing. Um, anyway, the last one I grabbed is Vintage and I love the label on there. Ugh, I just love her whole aesthetic. Um, the notes on this are Cypress and Fur Needles, Plum, fig leaves, cinnamon cedar with hints of smoldering wood. So there's that smoldering woods again and everything else in here sounds amazing. I'm just, uh, I'm so excited. Okay, I'm like waiting because I'm trying to like savor the moment. Um, I'm gonna put this on the floor because it's falling. Okay, let's see. Oh, 
Oh, wow. Okay. So I'm trying to see. That is so good. I'm definitely getting the fig. It's like the first thing that's hitting me in the face. That is beautiful. I'm so glad I grabbed this. This just smells like, I think vintage is the perfect name for this. It smells like vintage Christmas. Like, I mean, it, it smells like antique Christmas. <laughs> it smells like Victorian Christmas. Oh, that's so good. Um, I'm trying to think because something in here smells familiar and I'm like, is this like a type or a dupe for something like blended with other things? Something smells really familiar, but it could just be, you know, it smells like fig and I've smelled a lot of fig scents. Wow, I really like this. Yeah, um, and I feel like even more of those notes are gonna come out as it sits and then when it warms, that is just, oh, and it's so pretty. I love the white with the glitter. Oh my goodness. There's almost, it could be the cypress. There's something in here that's almost a little soapy to me. I think it's the cypress. Yeah, it kind of smells like your, it, like a Victorian Christmas. Like you just cleaned your Victorian home and then started like simmering spices on the stove and you are putting up your Christmas tree and this is so good. I'm so glad I got a tub of it. I'm definitely going to try some of this this month. And then if I love it, I'll get more for next year. If she offers it, I, she has to offer this again. It's so good. Okay. Anyway, that is my order. I'm pretty obsessed. I'm trying to think of what my favorite is. It might be this vintage one. Uh, because that is, that just smells like. I want to be there. I want to be in that house at Christmas time. That is so good. I don't know though. I like all of them. That oak cider and woods is really good. Oh, the north is really good. Yeah, I like everything. The ocean smells just like the Unstoppables. The Christmas cafe is super yummy. I like everything. White woods and bonfires is good. There's not anything that I don't like. I mean, obviously, you just watched and I liked everything. I really like this morning cup of Christmas, too. Oh, I don't know. It could be that one. I think vintage is my favorite. If I had to pick one, if I could only have one scent from this order, <laughs> it might be the norm. Uh, no, I think I would go with vintage. That is so good. Wow, I really like that. Okay, yeah, super happy with this order. Let me know if you picked up anything from the RTS um, and what your favorite scent was that you got. I, I just get more and more impressed with Teddy B's every time I order. It's just, I don't know. She has really good blends. Her aesthetic is amazing. She's a wonderful vendor. Like. I just love Teddy Bees, as does everyone else. So yeah, that's everything I picked up. Like I said, let me know what you picked up and what your favorite thing from your order was, or if you've tried any of these and you love them, or if any of these sound good to you, let me know. I hopefully have my bathing garden order coming this week. At least I should check and see if it's coming today because it said it was in my city a few days ago. Um, so I'm hoping it will come like today or tomorrow, um, but we'll see. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you're all doing well and having a wonderful December. Um, yeah, and I will talk to you all later. Bye.